little self-care moment because I just need it. I just need it. The mask that I am using, genuinely love it. If you hear creaking, I'm on my toilet right now. So that's that's what that is. <laughs> this is the Bless Mighty Marshmallow Bright and Radiant Whipped Mask. And I've really been loving it. It definitely makes my skin bright and glowy and soft. But my skin has been doing a lot better lately. I definitely wanna branch out though. This is almost finished. So if you guys have any mask, face mask brands that you're loving right now, leave them down below because I'd love to know what you guys use. What's up guys? I am in my closet slash office area. My thread up box just came in. So I thought that we would open it up together. I'm sorry if this lighting is not very good. It is what it is at this point. I genuinely love thread up. This is my second purchase from Get Up, so I'm very stoked. I had a great experience first purchase with them. Okay, so the first thing that I got was this bucket hat by Alice and Olivia. Oh my gosh. Wait, that's, that's really cute. I bought this because I'm really trying to protect my skin from the sun. It just has like cute little daisies on it. Oh my god. Oh my god. So I picked up this Dooney and Burke cross body bag and I think it's just gonna go with a lot of things. I love that it's not too small. I absolutely love that. So I picked up jeans. These are from Zara. These are so cute. These are the Zara jeans. They look so good. I love it. Obsessed. These are from Banana Republic. Boyfriend mid-rise straight um, high-waisted jeans. These are the Banana Republic boyfriend jeans and I really like them. They're like so comfortable. So it's obviously another day, but we are continuing on with this haul because stuff, more stuff came in the mail today. So I did get more stuff from Thread Up. So I'm gonna show you that right now. I just got shoes, three pairs, nothing too, too crazy. So I don't know, I don't know if many people will like these shoes, but I really like them. And I think that's all that matters. Just cute sneaks. These are from the brand Call It Spring and yeah, I'm just loving the pink. Then I got these slide-ons from Calvin Klein and they're just a nice off-white color. Thought it was super simple and I love slide-ons because obviously they're easy. And then I actually got a pair of combat boots which I just threw out today, a pair that look exactly like these they were all torn up and i loved them so i thought that i'd just replace them um they aren't exactly the same but they looked pretty identical it's just simple brown combat boots and i love wearing combat boots with dresses and jeans obviously this amara was kind enough to send me over a few things i got to choose five items so Thank you so much. I'm so excited to check these out. Islamara is a fashion brand. They are a small business, so I highly recommend you guys check them out and support them and buy a few things. So first things first, I got a pair of sunnies. They're just these really, ooh. They feel super high quality and I'm a little nervous actually because I tend to lose a lot of my sunglasses, but these are so dope. They're this really pretty blue color and yeah, I'm probably gonna be wearing these all summer long. The next item I chose was this black top right here. I love how it kind of crosses in the front and the quality just feels so nice. Like I can't explain it. Like it feels, it feels good. I know that these pieces are probably gonna last a very long time. I'm really excited to pair this top with high-waisted pants or even a skirt, I don't know. 
The next thing I chose was this adorable tank top, super lightweight, perfect for Florida, perfect for the summertime. I then picked up, oh, this is cute. Oh, she's a business girl. I don't own anything like this for a nice dinner or if I'm somewhere inside. So cute. So I might just leave it on for you guys. Last item, I chose this adorable dress. Again, quality is so nice, but I don't own anything like this. So I thought that these would look so cute with boots. Honestly, even this blazer as well. I'm very excited to wear this for a night out. Yeah, so that's all the stuff that I chose from Islamara. Again, thank you Islamara for sending me all of these amazing goodies. I'm obsessed. Everyone go check them out. down today because I think I'm stressed it's raining usually I really like the rain but I don't know it's just I really have not been sleeping the best lately because uh, I don't know I really don't know it's currently 1 30 it's a Saturday a few weeks ago I actually applied to college again I basically got accepted I also applied to one other school I haven't heard back yet so I will let you guys know for the past few years I feel like I've been very lost I'm thinking about filming a video about just being in your 20s and feeling lost because it's just definitely been my my situation for a long time now and although I, I have my associates I also oh dropped yeah i have my associates i have my certification in holistic health coaching which is really awesome i have been struggling with that because i love the wellness space and that certification and that program it really helped me realize that that i want to go into the wellness field but i don't know if i necessarily want to be a health coach like full time if i do it would be most likely be like a side thing or I, I don't even know but I I do know that I've come to realize that I miss learning I'm 24 so there's like a part of me that's like you're you're old <laughs> you know like you should have it figured out by now I just I realize how privileged I am and I'm so grateful for everything but of course there's a part of me comparing my life to the people that I see on social media and I just feel like I'm 24 and should be doing more and that is just such a toxic mindset to have because ultimately I have accomplished a lot and I've been through a lot and my feelings are valid even though my life may not be as difficult or as challenging as some other people it's still like we all go through stuff I'm just really learning how to navigate being in my mid-20s I turned 25 in five months. I, I can't, I can't think about that. I'm gonna start crying. So excited for school to continue with that. Wherever I choose to go, I knew going in that I wanted to get my, you know, finish up school online. I've already done the moving out into my own apartment, had roommates, 
went to school so i know that experience I really thrive online with a lot of things my holistic health program was also online and i killed that i learned better in that environment i get very distracted in a classroom setting i'm almost positive i have add so it's really hard for me to stay focused in a classroom setting it's something that i've always struggled with and it's been actually a huge mental struggle for me because I've been really hard on myself at times. I've come to realize I'm so much better working from home, online stuff. Not that I, I want to career-wise like necessarily work from home, but just like in general working from home, I'm able to kind of just move around and I feel more creative at home and more productive surprisingly. And I know that it's reversed for a lot of people, but yeah that's just how i've always been i'm very much a homebody and i don't mind it I'm just really trying to not go crazy my life is kind of chaotic right now but i'm very grateful for everything hello guys it is the 19th now i hope that you guys enjoyed this video i know it was kind of like i didn't get a bunch of content over the past few weeks this vlog also did not go up last friday <laughs> when i was supposed to i'm already slacking with my uploading schedule i'm obviously still going to continue to try and upload every friday that was just kind of like something that we're striving for but i again i'm not gonna beat myself up for not uploading every friday my excuse for not uploading though i had covid last week and also my girlfriend was in town so we both had covid we weren't really doing much um, obviously we're staying inside. We did a lot of fun things after that, but I didn't film at all because I just really wanted to be in the present moment with her. Whatever, you guys don't want to hear about that. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you, if you liked it by giving this video a thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe. It really helps me out and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys.